Hey guys, so uh, where we're at today is in, uh, let me hop around here. Where we're at today is in Lindsborg, uh, Kansas, and we're out in this field, and uh, this is a historical structure that's here, and this would be called a dugout, and the early settlers would have uh, built these with stone. I'm gonna flip around here. This would be a dwelling uh, that they would live in, and um, I'm not certain about where the fire would be set up, but it looks almost like in this area here, and we're gonna walk down this. They put stone inside the hole, and this would be a dwelling where they would live. It had some sort of um, some sort of roof uh, that would be made up there. You can see, of course, there's a large field here. This is all uh, you know, being farmed now, but back in this thick area here, there's a, a creek that runs, but I'm gonna walk down here, so just give you an idea of what the scale is of this, but uh, this would be where the early settlers would have uh, would have been living. So let's walk down here just real carefully. Here you can kind of see. Oh, I would say this is probably about maybe uh, six or seven feet wide uh, at the bottom of this and maybe about 15 feet long, something like that. But we'll try and get you to a place here where we don't have as much glare. And then you can see how they did this with the stone. And uh, so we'll walk over here and you can see some more here. Uh, it almost looks like there's, oh here it looks like there's chisel marks really uh pretty cool various size stones here and we were thinking that maybe this right here might have been where they would have had a fire i was looking to see if there was like kind of leftover maybe uh, burn marks ash it may have washed away here but this looks like it could be a place here where the they'd have a fire and of course be able to uh, cook but very very simple uh, dwelling there's just some leftover rocks here and I don't know what looks like there's some sort of mortar uh, I don't know if it was made with clay or, or what have you but uh, really fascinating to see that there's tornadoes that come through this area it's been a while I think it's been over hundred years since one came through Lindsborg, but uh, you know there'd be some safety being in the places low as you can get but uh all right guys so that's it that's the dugouts from Lindsborg Kansas if you happen to visit this would be a cool place to see all right we'll see y'all